five, four. So, you ever going to speak again? Come on, Joe, say something. What do you want me to say? You were right? You were right, okay, Tasty? Like you always are. You're the only person in my life who ever speaks the truth. That's not entirely accurate. Well, you told me what was going to happen. Which was what, Joey? What happened up there? There was some other girl. Oh, I'm sorry, Joe. The whole time I was watching them, I was just thinking, this is it. This is real. Just like Pacey said. This is the real thing. And, and then I realized that's exactly what I don't have. Keep looking, you'll find it. No, I won't. Isn't it obvious by now? I'm not meant to. <laughs> Why, because you're 16 and alone? Come on! No, because I'm 16 and in my entire life there's been two people who actually really know me. Dawson and... D this AJ guy didn't know you. I, I don't care how you felt about him, Joe. It, he didn't know you because if he did, he would never would have walked away. I was going to say you face it. Okay. Have you totally lost it? Not totally. Yet. <sighs> All right, what did you mean by that? By what? About me knowing you better than anyone else. Exactly what I say, said Pacey. You know me, okay? In a way that nobody else besides Dawson ever had. I, I'm not talking about Dawson right now. I, we're talking about me. What? You can't keep doing this to me, Potter. Doing what? <sighs> So I count on you and tell you secrets and... And you call me in the middle of the night to pick you up? Why? I'm sorry I called you. I, I'm not I... mad that you called me. I just want to know why you called me. You were the first person that I thought of, Casey. What does that mean, Joe? It means that... I guess it... It means that I can talk to you. And that you're there for me. Don't you ever get tired of talking? No, I don't. <sighs> well, I don't want to talk anymore. I don't get tired. I don't. I, I, 